place to come with, buddy. A man who was seriously injured by two off-duty LA firefighters has won a multi-million dollar settlement. Samuel Chang was held down and choked during a violent confrontation on Halloween night in 2015. It all started over a misunderstanding about some candy Chang was handing out to trick-or-treaters. CBS 2's Rachel Kim is live in Manhattan Beach where she spoke with the man's attorney, Rachel. Well, Pat, Sam Chang's attorney says even though they got $7.4 million civil settlement, it doesn't make up for his client being victimized twice. The first time when he was choked and held down by the firefighters. The second time when the criminal justice system failed him. You picked the wrong place to come with, buddy. Yeah. This is Sam Chang's cell phone video from Halloween night 2015 that shows off-duty LA City firefighter Eric Carpenter, who is dressed in a He-Man outfit, and other partygoers harassing him. The then 23-year-old college student said he was handing out candy in a Chatsworth neighborhood where his grandmother lived. The group accused Chang of giving drug-laced candy to kids. He was chased down, and as a neighbor's video shows, Chang ends up on the ground, Carpenter holding him in a headlock. Another Another off duty firefighter also holding him down. What drugs did you take? Why are you here? Why are you here? Please stop fighting us. The police report of the incident said Chang suffered severe head and kidney injuries. The LAPD also determined the candy contained no drugs. The district attorney's office soon charged the two firefighters and another neighbor with felony assault. But when the case got to court, Carpenter and the others were allowed to plead no contest to a misdemeanor. Our David Goldstein got Chang's reaction to the reduced sentence. My heart stopped and, and blood stopped flowing to my brain and yet this wasn't considered a felony. I'm shocked. Both firefighters were put on leave and ended up with a six-month suspension without pay. After they returned to work, David caught up with Eric Carpenter when he was off duty and asked him if he regretted what happened that night. The entire incident was regrettable. Certainly things could have been handled differently, but uh, we're, we're all trying to move forward now, and I appreciate your time and your interest in it. If you watch some of those videos and you really see what happened, it is outrageous. It makes your blood boil. Chang's attorney, David Ring, told us his client got no justice in the criminal courts, so he filed civil charges against the two firefighters and three others. Chang just won a $7.4 million settlement. It's a small measure of justice for him, uh, but this, this young man, he's got some permanent lifelong uh, injuries. When asked about the reduced sentence, the L.A. County District Attorney's Office told us that they believed a jury would not find the defendants guilty of a felony conduct based on the facts of the case. Reporting live tonight in Manhattan Beach, Rachel Kim, CBS 2 News.